Let's begin solving some of the questions from your Delhi University entrance examination for geography 2020 paper. And now the questions were very very direct, very very fundamental from what you have been studying in your bachelors. Some of the questions were very very simple for example who is the author of Cosmos. So the direct answer is Humboldt. Similarly Iritkund written by Ritter is one of the direct answers. Now Humboldt uh, was a geographer who travelled to Vesuvius in Italy and tried to understand the development his work has been written in 30 volumes translated into numerous uh, foreign languages as well the first volume was published in 1845 and later after his death in 1862 there was the fifth volume that was published and the term cosmography was introduced the next is who among the following said geography is concerned with accurate orderly and rational description and interpretation of the variable characteristics of earth's surface so the correct answer is richard hartshin Richard Hartshan in his book Perspectives of Nature of Geography explained about the variable characters of the earth's surface and geography providing an accurate orderly and a rational information and description about the same. So his works mainly related to economic and political geography and the basic philosophical construct of geography. The next is the Hartland theory was given by Mackinder. However, the Rimland theory was given by Spikeman. Spikeman say, said that who rules the region of Rimland rules Eurasia and who rules Eurasia rules the world. World. So that was the idea by Spikeman. The next is Norman Myers talked about the term biodiversity hotspots and there are nearly 500 vascular plant species that have been discovered as endemic and also there are uh, categorization where you have 30% of le or less of the original vegetation which should be covered as a biodiversity hotspot. Now this term was used by this British ecologist to understand rich biological communities of plants, animals and microorganisms that exist. This is a very very important question. The air quality report compiled by IQ Air air visual now uh, this said that out of the 30 world's po most polluted country, uh, cities 21 are from india ghaziabad in uttar pradesh is the first most polluted city in india followed by hurtan in china then two others from pakistan faisalabad among one of those and delhi is the most popular polluted capital city in the world so among the capital cities the most polluted is delhi from india now here second becomes the incorrect option because it's not the third it is the first most polluted so some of the questions were also based on the recent and the contemporary happenings that you must be aware about now frontal rain as it is called as is also the cyclonic rain uh, it is caused by the two different air masses coming together and the adiabatic cooling caused in the process the next is which of the following cloud is found at the highest altitude from the sea surface uh, from the land surface so among these the highest is the cirrus cloud now as you can see here uh, the, in the diagram you have cirrus cloud at the highest level then you have the stratus clouds the cumulus the alto cumulus and the stratus so stratus cumulus alto and cirrus is the correct order of the clouds that you can see Pangaea started to break during the early Jurassic epoch and that was around 200 million years ago as you can see in this diagram and finally the present day segregation as the world emerged has been seen so a very direct question from uh, the concept of plate tectonics and continental drift theory the next is uh, which of the following are related to river erosion and transportation so all these three are related to river erosion and transportation what is the difference attrition means two smaller particles collide among themselves and with friction they break off so that is attrition uh, corrosion means the particles get dissolved and the soluble particles are basically acted by the action of weak acid that is present and that is corrosion uh, corrosion and corrosion is also the abrasion where they are hit by either the wind or the water or any other force that carries it and uh, the bedrock the bed load basically behaves as a 
as a piece of sand paper and it crushes the molecules into smaller particles so that is the correct option so you have a b and c all of those as the right option a last question which among the following is the largest lake in the united states the correct answer as you can see in the map itself is the great lakes homes as we call them superior is the largest among those with an area of nearly 37 uh, square miles that is present now here Lake Superior touches the border for Minnesota, Wisconsin, Michigan and then you have Ontario in Canada. So those are the regions that are uh, touching the regions or are uh, outlining the regions of Lake Superior. So that is the right option. So these were the kind of questions that were asked in your DU examination. For getting the complete question paper, you have the link below and practice well. Most of the questions were very basic, very fundamental. Some of the questions from the contemporary section as well. And a good focus was also on cartography and GIS technologies. So focus on those topics as well. Have a wonderful day ahead.